What would you do if someone told you that we could save almost 2.5 million lives and reduce global crop losses by more than 50 million tons a year and curb climate change by up to half a degree Celsius by 2050 at the same time? Would you act? Of course! Welcome to the Climate and Clean Air Coalition to reduce short-lived climate pollutants. The CCAC is the first global effort to act on this urgent issue as a collective challenge. Uniting governments, companies and civil society. And complementing efforts to reduce carbon dioxide. After more than a decade of scientific results, a powerful case for fast action has been built that can no longer be ignored. What are short-lived climate pollutants? Black carbon or soot from inefficient brick production. Millions of small cook stoves. Diesel engines. Open burning waste and other sources. Methane emissions from landfills. And from the oil and gas industry and other powerful greenhouse gases like some hydrofluorocarbons or HFCs which are increasing at a fast pace approximately 8% per year from 2004 to 2008. But won't reducing these pollutants cost too much? Most reduction measures could actually save money. For instance, harvesting methane as a fuel to boost energy supply or preventing leakages from oil and gas distribution or improving the efficiency of stoves and brick factories. So what are we waiting for? Technology exists. Now we need the will to act. The coalition is rolling out fast action, leveraging high-level political will and bolstering existing efforts, catalyzing financing, raising awareness about best practices and testing innovative technologies such as eco-friendly refrigerants, forging new partnerships with key actors, for instance with cities, to harvest methane from landfills, and addressing SLCPs worldwide for scaled-up climate and clean air benefits. The coalition is growing rapidly, with new governments, international and non-state partners and private sector companies coming on board. Dangerous climate change cannot be avoided without rapid and deep cuts in carbon dioxide. But fast action on SLCPs offers complementary quick wins in the short term, globally and especially in sensitive regions like the Arctic. So, if you were told you could save lives, boost food security and reduce global warming by up to half a degree Celsius over the next few decades, what would you do? Support action on reducing SLCPs, including through the CCAC. Make your mark for a sustainable world now and into the future. Learn more about the CCAC at www.ccacoalition.org.